Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how to set up this GE Profile 2.0 Ice Maker. The model number is XP1023SCSS. This does not have the additional side tank, this is just an all-in-one self-enclosed ice maker. So for the setup procedure, you're going to need to be close to a sink because there's some drain lines around back. We're going to have to drain into the sink quite a few times. So around back here, we've got this, these two tubes. We're going to need to get to these, and we're going to have to put these into the sink and drain them out a few times. But to start off, make sure that it's connect. both these tubes are connected, and there's a little storage thing for it right there. And there's little clips, so leave them right there for right now. So before you turn it on, let's open up the ice maker. Now, this one does not come with a filter. Now this thing down here is not, that's not a, that's just a screen. If you have an actual filter, like a carbon filter, it'll be a really big filter, but just, you can leave the screen installed. But this is where we're gonna be putting the water. The first thing we're gonna need is five cups of water, and you're gonna put just one tablespoon of household bleach in this water. We're gonna put this in here, we're gonna do a cleaning cycle, and then we're gonna uh, dump out the let, it, let the bleach drain out, and then we're gonna do a bunch of fresh water rinses before we make ice. Okay, so I've got my water and my bleach. I'm just gonna pour it in here. Yeah, it can be kind of tricky pouring it in there. Okay, I had to put the rest of it in a smaller, which is easier to put in. So when you put your bleach and water in, it doesn't fill it all the way up, and now we gotta do a cleaning cycle. Okay, so I put the tank back on. You're gonna turn the power on. And see how it says hold, there's a clean button here. You're gonna hold for three seconds. So that light came on and it says cleaning. And we can hear a pump that kicked on in there too. And there's also like a fan running. Okay, so it says it's gonna take three minutes for this cleaning cycle. So after this cleaning light goes out, we're going to drain it with those two tubes I showed you on the back into the sink. Okay, so there is water coming into the ice chamber. So the ice chamber is not filling up. There's a drain in the bottom of the ice chamber that's letting the water recirculate. Okay, so that was right about three minutes. The cleaning went out. Now we're going to leave the unit powered on. This clean light is still on. This cleaning light went out. So now we're going to open the water reservoir here. Be careful, there could be some, you know, this has got bleach in it. So now we need to drain out that tank. Okay, so you just take those two tubes off. I've got the water coming out now. We're just gonna let that drain. Water's coming out of both tubes. And it's draining out inside here. Okay, we can see it emptied out this. I've got those two tubes open still. So while I've got those two tubes over the sink, I'm gonna dump just a little more water in here just to kind of give it one more flush to make sure to get all that um, bleach out of there. And see, I've got it, that water I dumped in is coming out of that tube. And then in the meantime, I am gonna rinse this out with soap and water, get this all nice and clean. Okay, so now you just gotta push those tubes back onto these drain pl or these uh, plugs. Okay, so I've got the tubes plucked off. Nothing's going to come out of them now when you've got that gray thing on there. Now we need to put five more cups of fresh water. So we're done with the bleach. Now we're going to do a bunch of fresh water rinses. Okay, so the power did go out. So this clean light went out first, but then eventually these lights did turn off. So we got to turn it back on and then hold the cleaning button for three seconds. So it looks like you can run this cleaning cycle without this installed. It does splash out a little bit, so it's, it might be a good idea to put this in. But again, this will take three minutes for this. This is called a fresh water rinsing now. So when this is finished, the cleaning light will go out. We're gonna repeat the process. We're gonna drain the water out, filled up with fresh water. We need to do this three times. So each time we'll have to turn it on, hold the clean light, 
and it'll go through this um, cleaning process. Okay, so I opened up the tubes again. We're, we're letting it drain because the cleaning light turned off. Okay, so now I've got the tubes reattached. You're gonna put them back here and there's these little clips to clip the tubes in. Now they're nice and stowed away. So after my third time of running water through here using the cleaning cycle, um, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna wash this all out with soap and water. I'm even gonna wipe this down one last time in here just to kind of give it a nice rinse. And then we're ready to make ice. Thanks everybody for watching. Check out my next video. I'm gonna show you how it makes ice.